here at the retreat at Charleston Peak is where Rock Stanley started his hike, but he never returned. After three and a half weeks, his body has finally been found about 11 miles away from here near Lee Peak. His family says he will be dearly missed. The Stanley family search is over. One of our volunteers went up with them and they were able to locate remains. Rock Stanley was found Saturday around noon. These pictures were taken near Lee Peak on Mount Charleston, near where he was located. Red Rock Search and Rescue was on their 12th search for him. Team Commander Craig McVeigh says with the help of a canine team from Los Angeles, they were guiding the direction where Mr. Stanley was located. They called Metro Search and Rescue, who sent a helicopter crew to collect his remains. Um, they did find the yellow jacket uh, and clothing that appeared to match the description of what Rock was wearing when he disappeared. He's been doing it for 30 years. It's, you know, he's comfortable with it. So this is the last thing we would have you know, thought could happen. Mr. Stanley had been missing since August 23rd. Two weeks after, we spoke with his granddaughter, Courtney Stanley, who was desperate for answers. We want to bring him home. We want to we want to give him a proper military burial, you know, that he deserves. Today, his family is grieving the loss. We spoke to his granddaughter, who is heartbroken at the news. She sent us this statement from the family, which says the finding of rock is truly bittersweet. We now have closure and can grieve, but we are heartbroken to have lost him so soon. There is a peace in knowing he went out doing what he loved, but we will miss him every day. And once you have answers, you can begin the grieving process um, and, and move through that process. McVeigh says based on the terrain where Stanley was found, the search team believes it may have been a fall because it was a steep incline about a 30 degree slope. It would be hard to, to walk in or accidentally get to where he was. Um, so. To us, it, it would seem to indicate that he may have taken a fall. The Stanley family says Rock died doing what he loved and will be remembered as an honorable man. He was a lieutenant colonel. He served 36 years as a Marine, and that's all he ever wanted was to be buried in a military. You know, he wanted to have a military service in a military cemetery. We want to give him that. McVeigh says up to 150 volunteers helped with this search. He says Red Rock Search and Rescue is deeply saddened for the family, but they are proud to have been able to find Mr. Stanley. I'm Abel Garcia reporting from Mount Charleston.